I'm going to demonstrate a quick search using the CINAHL Complete database. I'm going to search for some literature on palliative care and spirituality. You can enter your search terms into the search boxes using one term or concept per box. So here I'm searching for the term palliative care and then I'm combining it using the word and with the term spirituality. This means that the journal articles that come back in my results list should be about palliative care and spirituality. Not one or the other, but both items that should be present in the journal article. When you click search, you'll find the search results appear in the centre of your screen. You can see here we found just around 1,000 results. That's quite a lot to look through. So if you use the panel on the left hand side, the refine results options, you can limit your results down a little further. You might want to limit your search by date. So you can either type into the boxes or use the date slider. You can see here we've found just over 400 items. You can also reduce your results further and make them more specific by choosing options under the age group gender, or even the geographic location options. So those are all ways that you can refine your search to make it more specific and reduce those numbers down so you can easily read through the results that are returned. If you want to read an abstract or a summary of a journal article to give you an idea of what it's about, click on the title of the article and it will take you through to a new page. If you want to read the full text, either follow the full text finder links or use the PDF download button. You might want to email or print some results out. You can do that by clicking the blue folder icon next to the items you're interested in and heading to folder view and from there you can choose to print or email. There are two more tips for using CINAHL. When we did our original search, I typed just palliative care into the first search box. But there are other words and phrases that mean something very similar. So I can add those into my search. So you can see here I could use palliative care or end of life care or terminal care or hospice care in my search box. As long as the words all mean something very similar and are connected by the word or, you can put multiple terms or phrases into a search box. So I can do the same with the spirituality search. Then when you hit search, your article results will show anything that mentions palliative care or end of life care and so on. Another tip is that if you have quite a complex search and you've got multiple keywords you want to include, you can use the third search box and you can add more if you want to. Finally, the search history option is a very useful function. In the search history box, you'll find the history of your search since you logged on for this session. So here's the first search I carried out on palliative care and spirituality and the number of results I found. The search history box then shows me my second search where I added my date limit and how my results were reduced down to 400. Then it shows me the terms I used on my third search where I use multiple search terms in each box, I've still got my date limit applied and that's how many articles I found. So if you're in CINAHL and doing a search and you want to keep track of what you've done, go back and work out how many articles you found or which keywords were bringing the most results back for you, you can use the search history box. As soon as you finish your session and close CINAHL down, this information will disappear. So if you really need it to include in an assignment, you can use the print search history option. And last but not least, you can always clear the search box and begin again.